Reese's. We're going to get jazzy today. Okay, jazz, jazz. Alright, so I'm moving the Venus flower, Pice, Pice, honey. She is glorious. Okay, we're going to burn some jasmine. Let's see what's going on with the Pisces, honey. Alright, so I have this as well in Pisces and Sagittarius. Because I know that right now, the age that I am, my Sagittarius is highly influenced right now. Mm -hmm. But she's a thousand percent Pisces, Pisces, honey. Never forget that. Alright? So, cheers to all the water drinkers out there. We're going to fill up on some water and get started. So, if you're drinking wine, whatever you're drinking, get your shit ready. Okay? Because it's getting hot and steamy in here. Okay? Hot, hot. So, we have a new card deck here we're going to use. But first, let's get it all juicy and jazzed up. Alright? Let's loosen some of these stuck energy. Alright? Some people... I'm feeling like I have a, I have a message here. Alright? Some people feel you know like they got or their partner has like a stick up their ass or something stuck right someone needs to release right some stuck energy right and my peace lily is having a difficult time i have to take give some tlc some reiki you know hands on healing so i want to thank all my subscribers you know what i'm saying who's in who's joined my channel all my new subscribers we're about to get jazzy on the full moon Okay, I'm about to send out those care packages. So, I'm receiving all the email addresses. I'm loving the energy. Powerful, baby. Alright, so let's see what God has in store for my Pice Pice family. And because you guys are spoiled, I'm going to post this video right up today. Mm -hmm. I do my readings the same day. I do not like to do, like, pre-record readings. That shit don't make no damn sense. If you ain't got the time to do the shit, the time that, you know, that you do the readings why why set it up i don't know i, I need to stop talking shit y'all all right actually ouch pice pice hold on as you know it's raining right now and i can just feel the energy of spirit like crystal tell them tell them okay tell them the channel message all right so some of us are getting steamy with it okay like I said, watch that movie, Baby Boy and um, Jerry Maguire, An Original Sin. That's how you manifest love as well. Alright, and let's hope that everyone received their little care package. Okay, Pisces, the queen is back. Alright, so the thunderstorm literally stopped. I wish I was doing a reading storm. The thunder. Alright. What do we have, God? Who's coming towards Pisces, sexual energy, or romantic love? Ooh. The chariot. Tap that ass. All right. Okay, somebody is trying to spank it, right? Pisces. Someone is saying, turn around and let's get to work, honey. Okay. Guess who this is? This is the chariot. I know better. I know I'm on my P's and Q's because I'm going to keep getting the same fucking channel messages. You got your ass up. Okay, you saying, go ahead. <laughs> By all means, go, go deep sea diving. All right? Because there's a waterfall. Okay, prepare for that waterfall. Is a river flowing, honey. Okay, make sure y'all drink that aloe juice. <laughs> and mix it with some pineapple and celery. Yep, there you go. There you go. <laughs> As a waterfall. Alright. Let's see. Pisces got. Yeah. I just want to be with you, Pisces. I don't want no other. Okay. Yeah. Look at this. I am obsessed. Okay. With the judgment and the ace of swords. I want to finally be honest, Pisces. You're all I want. Okay. I was a fuck up. Don't judge me for my bad behavior. My past actions. That's a Cancer or a fucking Libra. Mm -hmm. And you might as well throw Aquarius um, and Gemini the motherfucker because we got the Ace of Swords. And if you don't like my language, to the left. Don't have me on this mother lover twerking. Alright, who's coming to us, Pisces? Yeah, twerk, twerk. So someone is not, yeah, I'm getting a message from somebody who is a, um, a crazy bitch Gemini can't perform. Alright, they're lacking. <laughs> they're lacking right 
they can't yeah they're not doing it so if they're dealing with they if they left you for a, a Aquarius Libra Gemini that person ain't doing it right okay this is all a crazy but Gemini that person is like looking stupid because she's thinking about her career right the seven of swords lying and stealing the five of wands okay fighting and the eight of swords being mind trapped yeah someone is like not really trying to um put the work in all right yeah look at the sun oh my god i love it i want to have the sun with you pisces the eight of wands what was i thinking putting you into this third party why did i take long to compromise with you i was stupid i want to have the sun with you this could be a leo as well and you have the two of chalices look at this oh my god the soulmate and the sun crystal is on her p's and q's y'all huh and if you don't like it to the left okay this is love baby two of chalices i seen someone left me a message talking about well why my love ain't here well i don't know what type of energy you have that's why you need to book a private okay it's someone from the past it could also be a stupid ass virgo <laughs> or taurus having major regrets what was i thinking not a value in you the non of chalices okay i thought i wish wish fulfilled with the crazy but gemini but i'm not i need you back into my good graces someone is like please and this is you pisces like i had said before you sitting here with all the apples and shit you know come and get it you know if you come in come in right here's the king of cups pisces cancer scorpio baby i'm good and the seven of pentacles okay the seven of pentacles is like defending the family but this picture is just you guys this weekend i'm seeing this weekend on seven days two of wands someone in a distance and you have the two of pentacles no longer juggling i'm sorry i juggled you i'm sorry i was fighting with you i had you in your mind about this relationship same two cards again i had you in your mind four of cups i made you an option i breadcrumbed you yeah so that's what i'm getting pisces this is crazy i love it i put you in this third party okay you walked away i thought you would contact me you didn't yeah because the priestess you know everyone listen to the high priestess crystal honey okay sending these warning messages to you motherfuckers mother lovers out there we ain't playing with you we're gonna lay these cards out okay we're gonna confirm some of these losers here but not everyone all right so it's someone from the past let's confirm the kings and the major arcanas so far we have a virgo major arcana a taurus Miss it, someone from the past. Look at her. She lifting up her breast like, go ahead and suck on that shit. You, you, <laughs> you see that Pisces? Okay? You deserve it. She's like, go ahead. You know what I'm saying? Huh? Y'all can't see me do grabbing my shit. Lift them up. Okay? Get to work. You got some fucking making up to do. Right? You got the two of cups. Soulmate energy. Seven of pentacles. Okay? Someone wants to lay now with you like this, Pisces. And the King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. All right? So you got the Major Arcanas, Taurus, Virgo, Leo, and the Cancer. Crazy as motherfucking Cancer. And the Libra. Okay, so we do have a lot of Majors. Let's confirm some, some of these fuckeries and see what the fuck going on. Why is this chariot here? The Page of Swords, Okay stalkerish stalker okay stalker alert pice pice okay is a stalker alert all right stalker alert let me stop this damn because y'all know y'all gonna kill me why is the judgment here god for pisces you see the way that just flew out flying everywhere oh the ten of cups okay so it's a legal commitment someone wants to really give you this commitment pisces believe it or not okay it's coming some of us already have it or it's coming it's a libra or cancer running forward with the apology all right why is the uh sun card here for pisces spirit chariot and the judgment here all right so someone wants to really commit here let's clarify why is the chariot here guys for pisces um yeah the queen of cups 
someone wants to have a rebirth Pisces and stalker and you had the devil reverse I mean the devil was Capricorn so you might have an option between a cancer and a Capricorn all right but you have the queen of cups Pisces cancer Scorpio major arcana uh, chariot all right you guys are a couple here all right okay and someone is stalking as well and you have an ending all right so some some cancers are ending the relationship with you or you're ending the relationship with them or is a rebirth right okay yeah the will of karma here is here so you guys are going to rekindle the relationship why is the judgment here for pisces it was another person involved who broke your heart or who came between this relationship a crazy be gemini and just like i said always you need to book a reading you also have a crazy be gemini um messages coming in why is this ace of one ace of uh voices here you have the full reverse not taking this leap of faith with the aerial sag all right or someone is in the middle of this relationship and causing the relationship to be at a standstill all right, they could have also left you for a Sag or a crazy the Gemini, and now the, the Cancer want to return. Why is this Leo here? So this is the Cancer story. Stay with defense, especially when it comes to family. So this person is trying to have the sun with you. All right, even it might also be a Leo. You know what I'm saying? They are the babies of the Zodiacs. All right, they like very babyish. You got to walk away from them, and then that will teach them a good lesson. Why is this? Ooh. We're not going to keep it, but I'm going to look. We have the hangman, the two of swords, cutting off communication, and the nine of wands. Yeah, you guys was defensive when they decided to just venture off into the wilderness and, you know, MIA and ghosts, that ghost and bullshit. You guys became defensive. Yeah, look at this. King of Cups. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Now we have a couple here. Okay. And it was no equal balance, but now whoever you left, all right wants to reconcile and rekindle this relationship with you pisces okay they want to come in and now finally offer you stability all right bear with me with this light the lens all right someone wants to offer you stable a stable relationship right so that's what i'm seeing a pisces cancer scorpio or maybe a leo okay but like i said if you decide to go with the leo the motherfucker, the mother lover is not staying. I also see some people turning into like some type of scarecrow. Right? If some people are not eating. If you, I see somebody is looking like a, a, shrivel, a shriveled up prune. Or some type of, I don't know, I can't get the name of the person, the animal in my face, in my uh, vision here. But, um, yeah. <laughs> Let me. I guys, I can't. You guys, I just made a mistake and turned the camera off. What the? Okay, so you have a stability here. Let's figure out Pisces and this because I'm tired now. Final message, God, for Pisces for the next few days. The three of coins. You overworking the palace of cups. So you have three palaces. Oh, page of cups. An apology, okay? From a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, and a page of wands. Okay, you have two pages, an ending here, okay? It's an ending, but not an ending of, oh my God, we got three pages. What the fuck? And the Wheel of Karma. And the Moon, Pisces, Cancer. This is a secret or something that is going to be revealed, okay? Around the full moon. The Moon, Pisces, Cancer, Energy, Sagittarius. I secretly love you. I'm sorry. I'm stalking you, okay? I don't want to really end this relationship. You have three pages. Look at this powerful pisces powerful or spirit could tell me that some of these people who has the pages could be secretive hidden secrets with a pisces cancer aquarius the gemini aries the sag watch your back period all right because someone is not really working they're going to tell you okay i want to be committed and not going to commit all right and you do have fortune so let's ring in let's ring in that money honey all right, so we have three cards that came out this morning. We have a blessing on a battle that cannot be avoided. Okay. These are um, fairy godmother cards. Okay. And we have a couple of new decks coming in the mail. A blessing on the children. And blessed be the children. All 
Okay, let me see. Some some messages for Pisces, guys. Psalms. Ooh, came right out. I love you. Oh my God. Can you guys see this? I love you, it says. My strength. I love you. I'm telling you, Pisces. <laughs> okay? I love you. This is your partner telling you, I love you. It is God who arms me with strength and makes my way perfect. 18-32. Okay? Listen to the high priestess, baby. Okay, bless, bless B book. This is a fairy book just for my Pisces family. A blessing on the children. A blessing for your own children and for the children within our lives. For they are all our children. Only you as the mother or father know the tender moments. You have seen the first cry, the gaze of wonder, the curiosity of the newborn in love with the world. Or howling at the teeth of hunger within the belly. May the children of the world be most blessed as they move from babe to child. Learning the gifts of speech and movement of thoughts and awareness. As they move from being intertwined with mother to becoming their own selves, may they be guided with understanding and be taught resilience and strength of character. May their falls be lessened from which they learn to rise up, steady themselves, and continue. May they learn that kindness to themselves need not forego kindness to others. May they be taught the gift of self-love, self-awareness, and may every step they take be washed over yet be without impediment. May they have teachers within schools that foster respect and understanding, and may their teachers show them the way to example, enlightened and wise. Let the innate goodness within come to fore, and may they learn to be their best selves, even amidst the harshness of the world. Let every false step be followed with a redefining, a refining of their way, and may the blessing of their love you have borne them to be born through their love and contributions to the world. May their nature be allowed to come forth, and when they change the world in ways their elders fail to understand, may they have the strength to embrace them and bring the old ones into the next world they are creating. And blessed be. Namaste. Okay. Okay, Pisces. A blessing on your love. A blessing on the discovery of the affinity of one soul for another. May the fragile beginnings of love between you bring to life qualities within you. They will be your soul's true calling. May the sweetness of the taste of the lips that kisses yours be matched by the kindness and patience you find for each other. May the darker times that beset all companions of the heart teach you that what to hold on to and what to open your hands to easily let go of. May the embrace of each other's arms become a sanctuary from the world, yet not keep you from it. Instead, this love, instead may this love send you back to the world restored whole, eager for the knowing of it. And when you return to each other, may there be space for both of you to share and to learn what shaped you that day. Let passion be long lived. Let your spirit flame be both tender and stoked by each other. And may you be a friend of the soul, a bringer of laughter and a light in the times when shadows gather and fall. If you should leave, one before the other, or choose to go, let it be without lies or mistrust. Let it be natural, order of things that your love burn brief and bright. But if it is right for this love to endure this, to endure into the years far beyond, let it be good, enriching, and solent to self. For your years as an elder, let this love be your light, and may it guide you well, warm you always, and help you see all more clearly. Thank you. <laughs> Ble a blessing on a battle that cannot be avoided. A blessing to help you through a conflict that must be faced with courage and compassion for all involved. 
battles in our lives are not always the way we have seen them. They may not be a fight or confrontation or the clash of swords swinging. Most of us do not want the battle. We want peace and we want to talk. Parlay our ways through the differences. Parlay our ways through the differences and the difficulties within our lives. Many times we may walk away knowing that the battle will bring more damage than we can face. And at other times, we must walk through the fires of confrontation and go into the battle we did not want, but which can no longer be avoided. So this is a blessing on those who are to face a battle they wished was not theirs to fight. But it has become clear that you have no choice but to confront, to bring out their arms and to fight. It may be with the Lord, it may be with the wits, it may be through speaking your truth, and it may be by refusing to accept what another has determined is enough for you. It may be with a challenge or a condition or injustice or cruelty. This is exactly what I had said earlier this morning. Whatever the nature of the form of the battle before you, accept now this blessing upon you. For your courageous, for your reluctance to bring aggression into the world, for your refusal to run, for your determination to see the story through, and for the belief you now have in yourself and whatever caused it is that you now stand up for it. For your warrior's heart, which is blessed with courage and strength, or the feelings of fear, yet the ability to stand your ground. For the swinging of the sword, the raising of the shield, for the quiet and the chaos that you will find and for the sacrifice you will make in order to see the truth in order to see this through. You are blessed and your warrior spirit is rising and it is blessed. For you are no aggressor or foolish conqueror. You are a soul who will no longer run for what stands between you and the rest of the beautiful life. I'm about to cry. Namaste, God bless everyone.